morning, Josh. How are you? I'm doing well. How about you? I am well, thank you. I really appreciate uh, your, your time. I'm Jay Rothman. I'm president of the, of the system, and it's a, a real pleasure to have some time today just to chat with you about your experience at UW-Superior. I'm excited, so yeah. Excellent. Well, why don't, why, why don't we get started uh, right off the gate? Tell me a little bit more about yourself, your hometown, uh, your major, your interests. Yeah, so I come from a small town called Osseo, Wisconsin. It's about 20 minutes south of Eau Claire. Um, but I'm here at UWS in my senior year studying theater and digital filmmaking um, with minors in writing and music. So um, I spend a lot of time in the arts building on campus and my interests are really in the arts at the moment. I like doing films, I like doing theater um, and a little bit of music in there as well. I bought a piano this summer so I could get really into my music minor. So, so you're a pianist and, and, and a theater person, it sounds like. Yep. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. What drove you and what what drew you to uh, UW Superior for uh, for for seeking your four year degree? Well, I really enjoyed how small the campus was. I'd been up to Superior a few times before actually touring campus, uh, so I really like the small campus size as well as like um, the family aspect. That that's kind of what kept me here is how small and how much of a family we are here at UWS. So tell me about your experience in the theater program at, at Superior. What, what has it taught you um, and where do you see yourself taking your education and into your ultimate career? I, like Being in the theater department has really taught me the importance of um, connections and communication because um, every, like, every other year so far I've made a film in the theater and film department and you need to have a ton of communication with your friends and your actors with this degree, as I continue on, um, I'm going to finish it off with a fifth year with the minor. Once I graduate, I'm going to, at least right now, pl plan on trying to see if I can find a job in the theater department. My first kind of place I really want to go is actually Madison. Um, the Overture Center um, and all the, th all the theaters down there are really beautiful. Uh, but if that doesn't work out, I've always, there's always the theaters up here in Duluth. Um, as well as in the Eau Claire area, so I can go back home and work in the theater department down there too. And, and if I were a new student or a prospective student and looking at Superior, what would you tell me? I would really emphasize that more one-on-one -on -one experience you have with your professors. Um, what's such a beautiful opportunity with this school that is so small to be able to have more one-on-one -on -one opportunities and to get that experience with your professors and with your advisors and just the faculty of campus being there for our students and being able to do that with a smaller university. But I would also emphasize really the um, really close family aspect that I have learned to find here on UWS. That, that, uh, that, those are great experiences and those are friendships and bonds that uh, if, if you're lucky will last your lifetime. And, and what would you tell uh, you know somebody coming into the university about how you balance, because you've been involved in a lot of things. How do you balance all of that against the, 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 the schoolwork that you have to do? And perhaps if you have a job outside that, uh, on top of that, what, would you, what, what advice would you give a student coming in? My advice would be to just get a schedule going as soon as possible and stick with that schedule. And just also as well with that schedule, being able to put in time for yourself because um, it is a lot of work to be a college student as well as an athlete and an actor on any campus and having jobs. So just giving that little bit of time to focus on yourself for a little, little while, whether it be playing video games with your friends or going out on a hike with your friends as well, or even just sitting down and reading a book, just giving that little bit of an opportunity to give that time to recharge and have that time to rebalance, um, get ready for the next day as well. Uh, good, good advice to be sure. Well, Josh, thank you very much for your time today. I really appreciate it. It was great to get to, to spend some time with you and learn a little bit more about your experiences at, at, at Superior. And I have no doubt that you are going to be successful in your chosen path. So again, my thanks for your time today. And thank you for giving me this opportunity. It was really nice. Take care. You too.